And welcome back to the channel everyone. This is Keith again and this go around with the Ryzen unboxing expect things to be a bit more subdued and less hectic than the last one. Now this is the Ryzen 5 reviewers kit that we just received a few moments ago from FedEx from AMD. So what we wanted to do was share with you what all we got in and what we would be using for the tests that we're doing with Ryzen 5. So this is a nice box. No, it's not wooden, but it is a nice cardboard box and it did come well packaged. So let's go ahead and it's Velcroed on there. So we'll go ahead and pop the top on this, pull that back. And very reminiscent of the last go around. You got the nice experience rising. Now I have opened this box already to put it back together. FedEx was not exactly uh, very forgiving if you will. So let's go through. Now this says 1600X over here and the 1500X over here, but whenever we pull it out, we'll see that this is the Ryzen 5 1500X. So it's all labeled sample right here. Well, 1600X. I don't know if you'll be able to see it in there or not, but this is the 1600X. I think they may have put it in the wrong box, but it is labeled right and we'll get that. So we'll take that and we'll set it back here to the side out of the way. Now this is the box for the uh, 1500X and it's labeled 1600X. Looks like it got put in the wrong box somehow. Interesting. Uh, <laughs> very interesting. But um, everything seems to be sealed up. I'm not sure what's going on there. But we do have a 1500X and a 1600X. So let's pull this out, get it out of the way. And we got a whole bunch of styrofoam pieces in here. So. I'm going to try and remember how these go so I can put it back together when I'm done. But for now, we're just going to set them over to the side. Now, they did ship in this, and I'm guessing that's because one of the chips doesn't come with a cooler. This is the Wraith Max cooler, which is quite nice. I'm actually a bit excited about this one because we previously tested the Wraith cooler and seen how it worked with the 1800X. I'm interested to see how this one holds up. Especially being that it's full RGB, I'd like to kind of play around with that because my motherboard will support it and allow me to configure it. But let's put that up and get that out of the way. So that's a cooler, two CPUs, and under here we have a kit of RAM. Well, this is a USB extension, or not USB extension, but a RGB extension. So I think that's for the Wraith cooler there, the Wraith Max. This is Gil Evo X DDR4. Now it says uh, Async Aura, Aura G RGB for ASRock, RGB Fusion for Gigabyte, and MSI Mystic Lighting. So that's nice. It'll work with all of the programs, especially with the Wraith cooler. Well, let's see about that one. Now, what this is a dual channel kit. There we go. This is 3200 CL16. Um, well, we'll see how this works on the motherboard, see if the motherboard will actually let us run it. I want to take a quick look at that while we've got it. Goodness, those are humongous dims. Those are not exactly small. Okay, well, we'll see how that works out for us. Um, an RGB header on it? Okay, well, we'll look at that later. Uh, very interesting there. So, we're up to two CPUs, an extra cooler, and a kit of DDR4 3200 megahertz RAM. And we got to run it all in a motherboard, of course. So it looks like AMD has sent us over the MSI B350. I'm going to go ahead and drop this down so we have this to, area to work with. Oops. So the MSI B350 Tomahawk. In our review, I actually recommended this particular board along with a lower SKU chip than the 1800X. So looks like I'm going to finally get to see for myself how that all works out. Go ahead and pull it out just to kind of get a look at it as we head out of this video. So pull it on out and I drop that. And that's actually quite the nice looking motherboard. There's not a whole lot going on there as far as extra stuff, but it is very, very solid. So that's a, uh, that's a wrap on it guys. This has been Keith the WCCF tech. And if you stay tuned, we will have quite a few results with both the 1500X and the 1600X in various configurations. So thank you so much. If you found the video informative or entertaining, please feel free to like, and subscribe, and we will catch you as always in the next video.